I'm Nicole Hacko with Royal LePage Top Producers and for today's local business of the week I have Brenda here with Enzymes. Yes. So can you tell everybody um, what this product is? What Enzymes is is a live nutrition. It's a, it's a supplement that goes into the animal's food and okay. every single piece of it is alive so you're giving the body life. Okay so this is for animals not for people oh no it's for people too okay yeah actually everything that this company has is the same for animals or for people okay so the only difference to, is the picture okay on the product some has people some has animals okay. so but it's yeah it's the same okay so um i guess what is the benefit of this and what is it used for Oh, everything, everything for from A to Z. I ended up finding this um, almost seven years ago. Okay. We had a little dog, her name was Bella. She was a Pomeranian Japanese chin and she became paralyzed. She was four years old. Mm -hmm. And we were told, like, of course, we rushed her into the vet. It was the middle of the night. And they told us that short of shipping her to Minneapolis or Saskatoon for surgery within the next 48 hours, she would never walk again. And I've been a stay-at-home mom for you know many years at that point and we didn't have the minimum four thousand dollars to pay for the surgery and it didn't have any guarantees which is one thing yeah. too you didn't know what was going to come out of the end so but we also didn't really know what had caused her paralysis and short of sending her to Saskatoon or Minneapolis we really didn't know so it was a big what if you know mm -hmm. what can happen and I ended up we had one other dog at the time and it was the middle of the night and I went outside with him and I was, I, I mean, I sat here for hours and, you know, a day just so forlorn because in a moment our lives changed, right? Mm -hmm. My young kids didn't understand what being paralyzed meant. I couldn't really understand either how my dog had went from chasing the cat to being broken. Yeah. And so I was outside with our other dog, Miko, and it was the middle of the night and I'm standing out there in the sidewalk and I just, I looked up at the stars, I said, show me the way show me the way because I don't know what I'm supposed to do because everybody's saying you know now that our friends and family had found out about it they were saying put her to sleep yeah. don't make her suffer do the right thing and so when I came back inside I went and sat down on the love seat I grabbed my iPad and opened up the Safari the internet and there in front of me was www.enzymes.com open to the paralysis page hmm. so to me it was you know I start watching reading listening to yeah. all these testimonials going oh my gosh could this work for Bella? And my husband, as broken as she was, he he didn't believe at all. Like he came home and I said, like, don't be mad at me. I just spent, you know, $150 on this stuff. And he just goes, there, there, dear. I know you've got a big heart, but mark my words, that dog will never walk again. So we were able to bring her home from the vet as long as we kept her in the kennel for six to eight weeks, which was called conservative treatment. We ended up getting the enzymes on the fifth day after her paralysis started giving it to her every day into her food. Nine days later, she took her first steps. Wow. So it was, you know, I know it was nothing else but this. And it just, it just escalated from there with, you know, oh my gosh, if it can do this for her, knowing that there's no such thing as a placebo effect in animals. I don't care what anybody no, says, absolutely. right? They yeah. don't know they're getting anything different. And at that time, I myself had been suffering with Lyme disease for 36 years and I was less than two months away of having surgery to remove my bladder and have to wear a bag for the rest of my life. Mm -hmm. So I started taking this too and here I am almost seven years later and no surgery. I, no surgery. I still have my bladder and everything has been amazing and I now as a result of Bella, and sadly she passed away in August of this year, but because of her, I've been able to help over 500 other paralyzed dogs walk again. Wow. So yeah, so I like I talk to people every day, literally all yeah. over the world, when they call into enzymes and they've got, you know, really, whether it's paralysis or autoimmune disease issues, allergies is another really, really big okay. thing. They'll send them all through to me. And so I've been able to work now with yeah. thousands of dogs and people over the years, all because of this one little dog. That's so so cool. it's, I always say I have the best JLB. You know, mm -hmm. because I don't even look at it as a job, it's so rewarding for me. Yeah. And part of that is now, is taking in sick animals, yeah. right? I do a lot with Before the Bridge Senior Rescue. They take in all, only the dogs that are seven and up that are seniors, and okay. you always end up with a lot of health issues, you know, poor nutrition yeah. over the years. So we take in the toughest cases, you know, the ones that they say there's no hope for. 
and they end up you going around. Yeah. yeah so it's it's incredible how yeah. something so simple which is just literally food can make all the difference yeah so yeah so Super that's cool. that's what enzymes is all about okay um i'm trying to think of like what other questions might other people or what do they usually have about the product when they come to you um well it, it basically it is what can it all do mm -hmm. right and when you give the body a living nutrition everything changes like you can look around in my house you'll find a few odd dog hair my animals don't shed Mm -hmm. We could go up to wherever that border collie is right now and grab a fistful of his hair and you might get two, three hairs stuck in your fingers because they don't shed because okay. their body is being nourished properly. Yeah. Same as me. I used to lose handfuls <laughs> of hair. And I now, sure do. Right? And now, like, it, 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 I don't at yeah. all anymore because my body is healthy. Mm -hmm. So what it can do, I mean, whether it, it basically, it really it boosts the immune system, right? Okay. Like, we don't get sick. My dogs, they don't get sick, mm -hmm. and yet with me taking in as many of the sick animals as I always do, you would think my guys would pick up. They never pick up anything. Yeah. So, yeah, so shedding, respiratory, digestion, yeah. um, even mentally, you know, like yeah. the one dog that we've got here right now, Gus, he came to me as an allergy dog, autoimmune disease issues, okay. but literally with having him here in just a few hours, I discovered that his physical issues were from here, right? It was his environment that he was in that was not, mm -hmm. and nothing against his owners, you know, like we're, we're, we've worked on all of that to create the same environment for them as we have had, as we have here for him, but it was the environment that was making him sick. So, you know, and that's happened before where I've always tried to focus on the physical end of the animal's health, not realizing just like yeah. humans, they have also the mental, right? So it's the old saying of feed the body, feed the mind yeah right so yeah it's it, it just it can do so very much even things like I talk to people all the time and you know they'll give me a, a description of something that they're encountering and I'll be like oh my gosh I used to have that too mm -hmm. and I don't even honestly know when it stopped you know and within yeah. the last seven years it just keeps getting better yeah so yeah so any sort of health issues um, well even on the back of here mobility joints muscles spinal okay. problems skin coat Hair loss, hair balls, shedding, everything. Digestion, energy, vitality, yeah, yeah seizures. Yeah, it just, it, the, it, from A to Z, I always say. Okay, super cool. Yeah. All right. Okay, so um, we'll have all the information up on the screen so that people can reach out to you if they've got any questions or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And then I guess that's our local business of the week. Awesome. Okay, so take care, everybody. Thank you. So <laughs> this is Bodhi. Bodhi is... Mm, we figure probably about an 11 year old he's border collie we've had him for just over five years now he came to us he had been found in a ditch out by amaranth manitoba and uh completely starving emaciated covered with burrs and ticks and the gentleman who found him really really loved him and but took him into the vet in town to have him be neutered and discovered there that he was suffering from congestive heart failure due to cardiomyopathy, which is enlarged heart. And his heart was in such bad condition that the right side of his heart wasn't functioning at all. And he had a grade six heart murmur. And on top of that, he also had stage four very strong Lyme disease. So Bodhi was assessed by three different vets and was given the no hope by all of them. They all said it was the worst case they'd ever seen. There's no hope for this dog. And so he was handed off to a rescue, a, the Border Collie Rescue we have here in Manitoba. And she reached out to me and asked if I would take Bodhi in and just let him live his last days, weeks. They, the, the, all the vets had said he had days to a week or two tops left to live. So when he arrived to us, he was in a, in a palliative care, palliative state and I uh, started him on my whole natural regimen with the enzymes and colloidal silver, Q10, L-carnitine, creatine, taurine, everything to help make his heart become stronger. And he didn't have a heartbeat because the only the left side of his heart was, was functioning. And by three months, I had a heartbeat and we had gotten rid of all the congestive heart failure and the, the Lyme disease was 100% eradicated. And at one year, his heart murmur was down to between a one and a two. 
and we were able to have him neutered which they said was never going to happen so and by three years after three years of having him I took him to a different vet who had no idea of his medical history and she had no idea that Bodhi had been as sick as he was so so he's uh He's, he's doing great now still. My husband takes and runs with him along the lakes out here a couple of miles a day so people probably will see, you know, the border collie next to the rollerblades or the bike, but he's living life. And so it's, it's really neat to see a dog that came here to die instead is living. And this is one he never, he didn't know how to play when he came to us. So it's, uh, every day with him is a gift and it's just, it make th this is the best reward of of doing what i do